All right, so like I said, Funky Tuesday, we are doing math in the morning. Weird, but it's happening, okay? So we're gonna start with, you guys took your assessment and you guys did awesome, you're doing fives all around. You did awesome, you did awesome, you did awesome, you did awesome, you did awesome. We all did awesome. Wait, I'm Wait we all did it, right? You all did I almost did. everything no, right? No, you no, all you did We did almost everything right. Can we sit with our tushies on the stools with our legs in front of them, please? That's how we sit on the stools in our classroom, thank you very much. We did so awesome that there's only three things that we have to review before we can move on to the next. Can you Matt, can you believe that? Three things out of all that stuff because you guys are awesome sauce, okay? No. So we're gonna start today, we're gonna do a little bit of work with tens frames. So everybody's gonna get a packet of tens frame cards. So why don't you go ahead and why don't you take your cards out? Okay. How many tens frames? A big stack of them you got. Everybody take them out. But remember, we have to keep our cards organized, so we're gonna keep our bag right near us. We're gonna keep our bag right near us, and we're gonna just keep our cards in our stack, okay? Uh, okay, now I know, it's like one dot. Do you need help putting them out? Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna play a game called Build It. We've built it before, haven't we? Yeah. We've, we've built numbers before. Yes. But have we built numbers before with tens frame cards? No. Have we built numbers with tens frames now? Yeah. Absolutely. We've done all sorts of stuff with tens frames. We've done addition with tens, tens frames. We've done counting with tens frames. We've done subtraction with tens frames. And now we're going to do build it with tens frames. So what I have on my iPad is I have the number and before we do the real before we do the answer on our on the iPad we're going to make our 21 okay so show me with your tens frame cards it's not 21 sorry the number 22 that's the number they want so everybody ready let's make 22 okay don't show anybody don't show anybody keep your keep your answer a secret Yep, hide, keep your tense frame secret. Wait, that's weird. It just counts them to another tense frame. Mm. The tense frames are all different numbers, though, aren't they? Yeah, but what part of Well, you gotta keep looking. You gotta keep looking. Let's see. Where's the number I'm looking for? Hmm. Bless you. Okay, I think I think I have twenty seven. I'm gonna double check. All right, keep it a secret. Keep it a secret. Hold on. Okay, I have my cards for 22. I'm ready. Take your time, take your time. Take your time. I think I'm ready. Whoa, we'll, we'll stack the cards you're not using neatly, and then double check your answer to make sure it equals 22, okay? While we wait for everybody else. While we wait for everybody else. Take your time, take your time. Take your time, we're making 22. Just stack them neatly. Just put them back in the stack, the ones you're not using. Just like, just like this. What is that number? And then double check to make sure this equals 22. I think it might equal more than that. So double check. You have your 22 ready to roll? I'm almost. I better have my dad. Keep your 22? Yes, Oh, already too many, right? Yep. All right, so down again and make sure you're ready. All right. I think that my tens, card, my tens frame cards are missing. Oh, there he is. Okay, so who wants to show me and discuss with your friends our answers? Me. Nava raised her hand first and she raised it quietly, so we're gonna let Nava go first. Is this 10? It sure is, she put a 10, what else? 
Double ten. What's ten plus ten? Fourteen. How many more does she need? Two. And did she do it? Yeah. Twenty-two. Give her claps. Good job, twenty-two. Why was I the only one clapping? There we go. All right, so Nava gave us 22 this way. Did anybody else give us 22 the same way as Nava? You did? Let's see it. We've got a 10, we've got a 10, and we've got a 2. Evan, did you do 22? 10 plus 10 plus 2, correct? Yeah. Give them clap for you. Very nice. Who did it a different way? Reed, what did you do? Sitting on our tissues on the stools, please. Oh, we did 7. Holy moly. How do we figure this out? We count the dots. We count the dots. So let's see. We have seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one. Did she do it? Yeah! Leave your cards out here. Very nice. Who did it differently than Reba? You did? Let's see. I said 2 plus 4 is 3. 3 plus 4 is 5. Holy moly, 2 plus 3 plus 5 is 0. What do we need to do? Actually, I think that we can figure this one out without counting the dots. What's 2 plus 3? 5. 5. What's 5 plus 4? Nine. 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 Oh, we're getting tricky now. What's nine plus five? Fourteen. And then what's fourteen plus eight? Eight. Twenty-two. Is fourteen plus eight twenty-two? Yeah. Who agrees? Did he do it? Yeah! Very cool. And did we just do an awesome job of adding numbers? Yeah, everybody claps for everybody. Woo! Are you ready? All right, show us what you got. Okay, so let's do, let's put your big one, your first number here. We had, you said you had 10 plus two plus one plus eight. So what do we think? Do you think that we can add these Add these numbers, or do you think we need to count these? Count. Let's add. Let's add them. Let's try adding. What is ten plus two? Twelve. Twelve. What is twelve plus one? Thirteen. Thirteen. What is thirteen plus eight? Let's try thirteen. Fourteen. That's eight. Twenty-one. What does he need? What do we need to one. add? One. Do you have a one card? Can you find a one card in your pile? Oh, right there. Oh, good teamwork. Plus, what's twenty-one plus one? Twenty-two. Twenty-two. Did he do it with a little bit of help from our friends? Yeah. He did. Woo! Do you guys want to see how I did it? I did. Ten. Ten. Plus. Plus. Five. five. Plus. Six. Plus. Whoa. Can we do it? What is ten plus five? Ten plus five. Fifteen. Fifteen. Who agrees? Fifteen. All right. Fifteen. What is fifteen plus six? Twenty-one. Twenty-one. Do we need? Do we, we want to? Do we want to double check if it's twenty-one, or do we agree with Nava that it's twenty-one? Fifteen plus six. What's fifteen plus five? Twenty. Twenty plus one, six. So that's twenty-one plus. Twenty-two. Did I do it? All right. All right. So this was. Nava's and oh, excuse me, Nava and Evan. All right, take your take your cards back. Let's see if we have another another try before we do what's next. What do we make? Let's see. How do we make? Um, ooh, this is this is a fancy one. I didn't look at this one yet. You just haven't had to really make it kind of hot. 
Okay. So they want us now to make the number 25. 25. No, we, we read the directions first. We don't just look at what's there and think that we know what we're doing. We have to make sure we read the directions. Do you want me to read them out to you? Because they didn't. They don't have the little microphone today. So let's see. Use the 10 frame cards to build the number 25. Then compare the two numbers. Okay, so the way that they built 22, they built 22 the easiest way you can build it. We built 22 in the, in the hard way, didn't we? We added a whole bunch of numbers to build our 22, but the way that they did it is they did it super easy peasy where they just did 10 plus 10 and then they added two. So that's the way they did 10, 22. Is, are they correct? Is that 22? 10 plus 10 is? 20 plus 2 is 22. So they did it right. Did we do it in cooler ways? Absolutely. So let's see, let's see how we make, let's see how we make the number 25. Right. I'm going to make it the way they're going to want to make it, but I want you guys to make it the super cool ways. Are you okay? All right, get to work. 25, show me what you got. Okay, I'm just going to do one tap. Show me what you got. I hope I have enough of what I want. Oh, I do. Okay. Where's my two? Oh, there However you can do it, okay? Can you keep your mouth quiet until everybody's finished? Thanks so much. Okay. I gotta check with mine. Okay, that's a lot. I gotta check with mine. I made an easy way. There's no easy way or hard way. There's the way that they ask for, and then our super cool ways. That's all we got. All right? No easy or hard. It's just the way we find 25. It's the way we find 25. But we're supposed to be hiding our 25s, aren't we? We're supposed to be hiding them? I use the four cards. Four cards is great. Four cards is great. I need five cards. How about six of these? I did. rest of your deck back in your bag, okay? So put the rest of your deck back in your Ziploc bag, okay? Just keep your 25 out, okay? Keep your 25 out and put the rest of your deck away, and you don't have to zip it because you're going to add to it, correct? Okay. Bobby's giving me one of his cards. No, he said he thought it was yours. 
It doesn't matter. Either or. Whoever puts it in their bag is fine. But try not to rip the bag. Be gentle, boss. It's easier if you lift it up and just let it fall in. Okay? Just keep it with you because you have more cards to add to it. Put this in here because we're not sure whose it is. It's fine. Alright, are we done? 25? Wait, wait. Sammy, how are we doing? Close? All right, finish up. We're gonna we're gonna let you finish up. I know how those That's a that's a pretty easy way. It's probably it's probably instead of saying easy, it's probably the simplest way we can do it, right? Simple versus a little more difficult. I don't know if difficult is the word there though. Okay, maybe. I don't even know that the ninjas would think to do it that way. We'd have to see. This is samurai work, so what on and The ninjas probably wouldn't because we don't do numbers up to past 20 with the ninjas, right? Right now we're working on numbers within 10. You guys doing a little teamwork? It's okay. Yeah. Teamwork's okay. I'm gonna go help friends. Well, now you have to count. Make sure count and make sure you have 25. Huh? No, I have 25. I know. I have 25. I got one. I feel like we have one down here. Um, college. No, those are those are the 22s. Those are mine. That's my 22. 18. Can you put your tush on your shoulder? I'll move these guys down to make it closer to you guys if you guys can keep your tushies on your shoulder. Okay? Thanks. Alright, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna get started. Okay? Are you guys close? Sammy, do you see what he's doing with your cards? Are you is this actually teamwork or are you just watching? Make sure you're counting together. We're making 25, love you. We're making 25. Okay. So Sammy, is that 25? Let Sammy count. Let Sammy count and let Sammy finish. You've helped really, you've helped him a lot. Give him back his cards so he can finish off. If you keep these two, if you keep these three, count these and tell me how many more you need, and then go find that card. We're gonna get started. So, we're just going to go swoop it around and we'll end with me the way that they want us to do it and then we'll do a comparison and then we'll move on. Okay? Reed, how'd you do it? Tush. Who else did it that way? Me. I did. I did. I did it that way. I did. Look, check it out. I got 10. I got 10. I got 5. 10 plus 10 plus 5. What's 10 plus 10? We know it's 20. And 20 plus 5, we know it's 25. Simple, right? Simple answer, correct? It's a simple. We're going to say simple because it's the same type of math. It's just the simplest answer. He finished. All right, so put your cards on the stack. Then here's your answer. We'll leave it here. Put the rest of those back in. All right, Reba, excellent work. Keep your answer right here. We're going to move to the next person. We're going to quietly help them put it in. What'd you do? 10 plus, hold on. Mm. 5 mm. plus 4 plus 1 plus 1 plus 3. <laughs> I got 6. It looks like, it looks like I got, got some math to do. All right, here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, what is 10 plus 5? 15. 15 plus 4? Uh, 17, 15, 15 16, 16, 17, 18, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19 plus 1? 20. Plus 1? 21. 22, 23, 24. What do we need? What do we need? What do we need? It's okay, take your time. I know we put them on the way. Alright, she's got it. What number what number is she looking for? One. Four. Who thinks one? Who thinks two? Who thinks one? Who thinks two? Who thinks one? Who thinks two? Give me one on your nose. Give me two on your ear. One on your nose, two on your ear. She's looking for one more because she counted. We added that up and it equals twenty. 
Four. And we need 20. Five. Did she find another onesie? Did you find a onesie? Oh, four. <laughs> what? All right, it looks like we gotta start over and do some more math. Here we go. What's 10 plus five? 15. Boom. What's 15 plus four? 19. Plus one. 20. Plus one. 21. 22, 23, 24, 25. Very, int card. very interesting what Nava did there because she had a three before. And instead of going to get us one more, she treated us with this card. Why did she treat us with a four? Because it's one more and then... You, I know why you did it. I want them to tell me why you did it. Why did she treat it with a four when she needed one more? Because, be, because, there was, because it's white. After number three, and it has, and it's uh, because, a bigger number. Excuse me, you're nailing it. Because four is how many more than three? One. One more, and how many more did she need? One. Beautiful, Nava, excellent work. I used six cards. You did use six cards, that's okay, thank you very much. All right, Arthur. Time out. Is everybody giving Arthur the attention he needs? Let go. Tushy's on your stools. Zip lips. Tushy's on your stools. Zip lips. All right, Arthur. It's all you. You got two. Plus eight. Eight. Plus ten. Five. Five. Let's do some math. What is eight plus two? Ten. Ten. What's ten plus ten? 20. 20. And what is 20 plus 5? Did he do it? Yeah. Very nice, because neither of the three of them, neither, I think that's what they would say, neither of the three of them did it the same way, did they? All right, let's see what Sam and Malicious has for us. Uh, <laughs> what do we got going on over here, boss? All right, Sammy, what is this? We got a 10. We've got another 10. And how many more do we need? Five. We need five more. How do we get five more? I don't think we need this one. All right, so let's let's, figure, let's, let's look at it. All right, let's look at it. You're right. If we need, if we already have 20 here, right? 10 plus 10 is? 10 plus 10 is 20. And we put in nine. It's 29. Is that too many? We don't need that guy. What if we put... This guy up here. What's 10 plus 10 plus 2? 22. 22. And then, can I have a three? and then how many more? Three. 20. Three. Three. 24. 20. Five. Did he do it with a little help? No. Very nice. All right. Put that number nine back in your bag because we don't need it. No. All right. Ev, what do you got going on here? Whoa. We got another six carter over here. We got another six carter. All right. What do we have? We have. Plus is 15. We got 15 plus 2. 17. 17 plus 1. 18. Plus 3. 19, 20, 21. 22, 23, 24, 25. Did he do it? Yes! He sure did. I think we were just more in shock and awe about your four and your three that we didn't even whoa. Our minds were blown. Our minds were blown. Sure, we'll get we'll get to class at the end for everybody. Alright. So here's my question. Because Abby, Reba, and I all did it the same way. So uh, why don't you recap and tell us how you did it? Ten. What's ten plus ten? Twenty. Twenty. Sammy, what's ten plus ten? All right. Plus five. Evan, what's ten plus ten plus five? All right. Put your fives up. I'm coming around. 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 I'm not one more. I'm not one more. Oh my goodness! One more, and then we gotta move on. We gotta move on. You coming? You coming? You coming? Oh, 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 great. Okay, okay. Put your cards in your baggies. Because then we're gonna we're gonna do a little we're gonna talk about this a little bit. 
Real quick, and then we're gonna do one more thing, and then we'll be done. Zoe. No, then you're, you're gonna go to recess. We put our shoes. Right, but we put our shoes on before we go to recess because they're covered in mud and they're outside already. So we're gonna get our clothes on, we're gonna get our lunches, and we're gonna go in the hallway. Anywho, all right. Can I have your Can I have your tennis frame bags? Put your tush. No, no. Put your tush on your stool. We're not done in math. Yeah, you We're not done with math. <laughs> Touch on your stool. I don't remember who's in this. That's mine. <laughs> we did 22. We did 22 before you got here. Alright, give me your bags if they're full. Bags if they're full. Bags if they're full. That's fine. We're still, can we keep our brain in math? Let's try to keep our brains in math, okay? So now, real, before we move on, before we move on to our word problem for today, we are going to look at these two numbers. We've got 22 and 25. What do we notice about them? What can we say about these two numbers? Yes. Very similar numbers. But are they the same? No. Mm, they're not the same. What else do we know? 22 and 25. Both of them, if you combine them, they equal 47. Whoa. Big maths. If you combine 22 and 25, we get 47. Is that true? Yes, we, yes it is true. Good job. Very nice work. What else do we know about these two numbers? Because, yeah. Tushies on the stool. You said in the beginning of that. Both of them have what? Both of them have tens. So let's say if we took away our ones and we only had our tens, what do we what do we notice about these two about these two numbers? They're the same. The same. And another word for the same is similar. What is this symbol? Similar. Equal. They are both, equal. these are equal numbers if we did 20 and 20, correct? They're the same, they're, the same, they're equal, they're the same number. 20 plus 20 equals 30. Uh, 40, Question. 20 equals 30. 40. No. I mean, 40. No. 40. Two, four tens equal 40, okay? Two twenties equal 40. Let's not get ahead of ourselves with that double digit math. But let's listen. So we know that these are equal, but as soon as we add the ones, what happens to them? Are they equal anymore? No. What's going on? Because one has a five and one has a two, uh, and two is less, and this is more. Less and more. Like the crocodiles. Like the crocodiles. I'm so glad you guys remember our crocodiles, and I'm so sorry that I don't have the crocodiles on me right now. But I made their friends the greater than and less than symbols. These are their cousins. These are the alligator cousins. Yeah. And I have a question. What number does the alligator want to eat? The bigger number or the smaller number? Bigger! The alligator always wants to eat the bigger number. So does that mean that I'm going to put this symbol here? No! Is it eating the bigger number? No. Or am I going to put this symbol here? Is he eating the bigger number? Yes! Yes! This, this alligator, like this alligator's cousin, if I was going to make him, you know, his, his teeth. Oh. Right, and it's like no. Yes, right if this alligator was hungry, which eat. number is he eating? This. He's eating twenty-five. Why is he eating twenty-five? Because, because it's the biggest number. Because twenty-five is greater than twenty-two, no. or twenty-two no. is less than you said twenty-five. The man. Do we have questions about our awesome, greater than, less than, remembering our alligator symbols? You guys, I'm so pumped you remember the alligators. So pumped. Why are you pumped? Because that was something we did last year, and I'm so glad you remember that. That is pumped. Pumped is like, I'm, 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 I'm pumped. Yes, it's pumped. All right. Are we done with this? Yes. All right, give me five jumping jacks and then come back. Nope. Give me five jumping jacks and then I said come back for the words. Alright. Let's not make random noises. Ev, what were the directions? Ev, what were the directions? I think. 
Yeah, you did because then you, you did win. directions. <laughs> All right, here's the deal. We're moving on to a little bit of an assessment. Okay, a little bit of an assessment. An assessment is when I check and see how your learning's going. And this is a very similar question to the one that almost all of you got wrong on our test. Which is why we're doing it together. All right, so everybody take a pencil and a cup. Okay, just take one and go, take one and go, take one and go, take one and go, take one and go. Thank you. We're all going to take our pencil. What is the first thing you do when you get a piece of paper? Write your name. Um, because I didn't, it doesn't, this one doesn't have color. Weird, right? Only the ones in our, in our workbooks have color. Alright, so we're going to write our names, correct? I have mine too. Alright, so what do we remember? I don't, I don't know if I've said this enough to you guys, but what do we remember? What's the most important thing about doing a word problem? There's actually, there's two equally as important, most important things. Read what? Read, read, no, you have to read the word. What are those called? Read the di directions. Directions? You have to read the directions um, from start to finish. Because otherwise, you won't know what they're asking. Just because you see some numbers going on, you don't know. You don't know what they're asking. Sammy, eyes here. Eyes here. You don't know what's going on until you read it from start to finish the, the question. All right, so I, let's pretend we read it. What's the next important thing? You have to read it. We did read. read. We you did read it. To. What's after, after you read it, what do you have to show your you work? Show your work. Show me how you got your answer. I don't want to say it's coloring letters right now because that tells me that you're not listening. All right. So let's read. Who's going to read the sentence? Who's going to read the first sentence? Read the first sentence for us. I'm going to read the title. The title says 11 fruits. How many of each? What do you think is important in there? How many of each? How many of each is definitely a question. And how many fruits do we have? Mm. All right. Abby, can you read what starts with salt? What's after that? Show your work. Boom. Solve the problem, show your work. So we're looking for answers, right? Can you listen, please? It says solve the problem, show your work. So obviously we always show our work. What does solve mean? Give us a answer. So we're looking for an answer of some sort. Who's going to read the next sentence? Arthur? Starts with I. What's the sentence? I all the way to the period. No, 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 no. I have. I have. Stop. That's the end of the sentence, right? A period is the end of the sentence. I have 11 fruits. What's important in that sentence? How many fruits do I have? I'm going to circle that. I have 11 fruits. That is important. I'm going to circle 11. I think that's an important number to remember in my brain. Sammy, are your eyes on your paper? And are your ears listening to the words happening at this table? How many fruits do we have? 11. We have 11 fruits. Very interesting. Did they tell us what fruits yet? No. All right, now we'll read the next sentence. The next two sentences. Some. How many, here's my question for you. How many different types of fruit do we have? No, that is not the answer to that question. How many types of fruit do I have? That those two sentences just told us what fruits we have. No. How? Listen to my question. How many types of fruit? We said we had apples and bananas. How many different kinds of fruit is that? Two. There are two kinds of fruit. We have apples and we have bananas. Right? Arthur, are you listening? Yeah. Your head's down, but are your, li are your ears on? Okay. How, so the next question, I'm gonna read the question first. It's fine, we're focused. I need you guys, I don't care what these alligators are doing because they're not doing our math work with us right now. They're on a break. Don't worry about it. 
I'm reading the next question. Are we ready? Here's question number one. How many of each could I have? How many apples? How many bananas? I don't want an answer yet because there's still more questions. The next one says how many apples? How many bananas? So in your box, it's very tricky. You need to find five or more combinations of apples and bananas, okay? So here's my question for you. Um, let's do some, let's do one together where I'm gonna use these guys, okay? These binder clips are apples and these paper clips are bananas, okay? So what's a common, how many fruits do I have all together? I have 11 fruits all together. So what's a combination I can have of apples? If I have one apple, how many bananas do I need? One. Ten more. Ten more. Why do I need ten more? Because I have how many fruits? Eleven. I have eleven fruits. So if I have one apple, and then I have one, two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Is that a fair combination to get me 11 fruit? Yep, yeah. One plus 10 equals? So here's how I wanna see it on your paper. I have one apple and I have 10 bananas. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Let me make sure, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11. So I have one apple, 10 bananas, one apple plus 10 bananas equals 11 fruit. Did you do it? Yes. Do you think you can give me another combination? Yes. Yes. Do it on your paper. I'm going to do mine too. Go ahead. Can we make a number? Shish. Everybody can do the first combination that I did. Everyone can do this. This can be number one for everyone. One, one apple, 10 bananas. Yeah, because I said there's one apple and there's ten bananas. I All right, you need five combinations. That's only one combination, and that does not tell me apples and bananas. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna keep going. Um, I'm going to do. Yeah. 
five combinations, not just one way. Five ways. Remember, we read the directions all the way through. It says show at least five at least five or more combinations and show your work. It looks like you have two. You're on your way. Keep it going. We're doing addition. It's only going to work with addition. You have no answers written, so welcome back to the group. Get going. Do you need pencil? Oh, Sammy has your pencil. It's okay, Sammy, keep going. You got one. You got one. We're going to do this for five more minutes, and if we don't finish, that's okay, because I'm going to have you guys later on, and we can go through it later on. Or you can even you can even continue working on it later on. If you only get to, great, you've got three. Keep going. You need five. Reva's doing great work. Keep your eyes on your own paper, please, and thank you. That's okay. Let's do some help. All right, so we did one apple. Now how many apples do we want to do? How many apples this time? You did one apple already. You need a different combination. Five apples. So one, two, three, four, five apples. And then how many bananas do we need to get to 11? Let's see, five. So what is it? Five and... There you go, boom. Okay. Oh, I did make the progress here. That's a funky looking five, dude. That's way too many lines. You only need five combinations of. I did like four more. I did more. I did all of the combinations. Because I want to make sure everybody's answer is represented. Do you want to know how many I did? If you want to do them all, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There are ten ways, there are ten combinations to make eleven. What about five plus five plus one? There's only two kinds of fruit. How do you have the plus one? How do you have a third number? There's only two kinds of fruit. Alright, so what number, how many apples do you want to do this time? Two more to go. Let's go. What do we got? Um, I am. Yeah. I'm done. Apples. 